I'm uh, Michael Bumandil, I'm the founder of uh, Sixième Son. Sixième Son is a pioneer and leading agency in the field of audio branding. We are only doing audio branding. It's a company with uh, 25 uh, people in Paris, in the United States, in Spain and in the Middle East. No, no, it's my first time and um, I would have been happy if the Audio Branding Congress was three days, four days, so that I can discover more of Moscow, but maybe next time. Yes, and particularly when I arrived from the airport, it was very nice this sound at the, I don't know how it's called, the Aero Express or the, it was very original, it was very surprising, so it was starting good, this journey in Moscow. Well, talking about sound opportunities is something important, but I really believe that uh, it's been now many years that there are huge sound opportunities. The question is how do we meet the market expectation? How do we raise the market expectation in a view to really developing a huge expertise to deliver a huge value? So I believe that the topic is good, but I believe that we need to talk more about precise question, question about how do we show that we are delivering value? How do we have brands going to us, not to the advertising agency or the branding agencies or the marketing agencies? So I believe that maybe it will take more than one day to talk about this. And I believe that the Congress is a good start to talk about this. I think the, 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 the answer is easy the opportunity is branding. I mean, in the business today, the competition is so hard that brands will only be successful if their branding is clear, differentiating, helping brands being understood. So, I mean, they will not be able to do the job without sound, because sound is everywhere, because sound is all in all the devices, because, a, because sound is such a strong language. So. I mean that as long as we understand that the topic is branding, the, the opportunity is, is huge. Uh, I'm very happy to meet all my colleagues around the world. I'm, I'm happy they liked the case I, I've come to present. I'm happy that we share some questions. I'm happy to talk about uh, the pricing of the audio branding, I'm happy to talk about uh, the development of the expertise, I'm, talk I'm happy to, to talk about all the topics that makes us, uh, I would say, expert in a growing market, but I'm still expecting more. I'm expecting us to be clearer on the vocabulary we are using. I'm, I'm expecting us to be stronger in our own branding. So, in my opinion, after this one-day congress, we will need to keep in touch much more, to talk much more, to help this uh, business uh, go forward. So, that's my opinion. I would say that uh, we won't succeed without a big investment. We won't succeed without big choices. And making choices, for example, is to stop doing everything but really to invest on audio branding. Personally, I believe that being a music production and an audio branding spirit has nothing to do. So maybe some of us, after some conversation, should decide to remain music house. But as for Sixième Son, Sixième Son, somebody asked me why is Sixième Son so successful? Why we are 25 pe people only doing audio branding? I really believe it's because it's been almost 20 years that we are investing in one and only field audio branding to deliver the best expertise for our clients so the client can get, can get the best value from sound and music for the communication.